Hey guys, it's Ryder. So, I'm um, gonna grab the other song. All right, so Anderson True just went live. And the Mako V.5 is confirmed, is a thing. Um, what is the Mako for 0.5? It's the Mako V4, but it doesn't snap in half. Amazing. At least they fixed the issue, but there should have never been an issue. Anyway, is the Mako, is the new Mako going to be worth it? No. Is it better than the one we got right now? Yes. So, you know, I mean, that's my opinion. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm happy that Lucas took it to heart. Um, I'm still going to boycott squid. I don't like squid. Um, I'm trying to get rid of pretty much all my products of squid. I, uh, I'm going to keep my squid boys, though. My squiddies. Uh, just because nobody wants to buy my cheap, crappy, beat-up, modded squiddy B. And I like to trash the squiddy. Uh, and I want to make a few videos about it. Just hating on it. Because that's fun. Um, I probably won't sell the OG either, though. Because it's, like, a must-have in everybody's collection. Like, it's so garbage that you should get it. Uh, it's one of those type type of things. Anyway, though, Mako 4 V4.5 is a thing. And will it be worth it? Probably not. Uh, is it better? Yes. And we want the Mako V3 back, though. That will never happen. Um, yeah. But I want to just say Atrophis. So I'm selling this. Um, I like this a lot, but it's time for it to go. And its replacement <laughs> will be a Trophus too, but, but it'll be a Live Blade. It'll be a, um, kind of a rep alternative type beat. Or I might trade for a Squid Trainer. That's an option. Um, Chicken Mon, um... You know, he said we could trade. I don't, I'm not sure about that yet, but you know what? It's not a bad trade. So I actually might get a squid trainer. Just interesting because I'm trying to get rid of all my squid products and then get a squid trainer. I don't know. We'll see though. I mean, it's the second market, so I'm not supporting squid industries up front. So I think it's somewhat okay. Anyway, though, I'd probably sell it even if I got it uh, about, like, four or five months later. <sighs> you know, that's just how it be. Anyway, that's an option. That's epic. Um, vortex. My epic vortex. Um, this thing, I snapped a screw uh, because I tried to tighten it super far. But, crap. I just lost the screw. Yeah, um, well, I'll find that later. That is quite horrible. Anyway, um, yeah, it snapped because I tried to tighten it a little too much, which is, you know, that's fine. Um, I'll live. I found it. I'll live, though. I mean, it's okay. Um, if I can grab it. I mean, I kind of snapped it inside there, so I do need to get a new one, but even, even like this, it still sounds pretty, very smoking hot. Like, listen to that. Holy crap, this thing's awesome. Um, rest in peace, the Vortex. No longer going to be sold. Um, never. Um, yeah. They are making the V2, so. Kind of sad, but kind of good. Uh, my Covenant. Gonna make a review on this sucker in a bit. 
uh, probably in a week or two. I have a lot of thoughts on it and hardly negative. Uh, this is just by far one of my favorite things ever to flip. Um, God, I love it. It looks like, um, I don't know why, but it reminds me of a penguin. I, I guess because, you know, penguins are kind of like black and white. This is kind of like silver and gray. Um, you okay, it doesn't make sense, but, you know, reminds me of a penguin. So it is what it is. And, um, another thing, I guess I got to clean that off soon. Uh, this thing, uh, after getting it back a couple days after they tuned, tuned it and, uh, fixed it after I was stupid and ruined the bushings, pretty good. Um, second favorite knife now. No, third favorite knife. Sorry. Uh, this thing's really good. Really good buy. Um, whew. It's definitely a heavy flipper, but uh, heavy flippers give you really good flows. You just can't go too fast or you will brutalize yourself. So, no, it's pretty good. Um, everything's I, everything's I, Mako, no, Mako, um, Alien's pretty good. No, okay, well, there's a little tap right now because I haven't tuned it in like a week. Um, yeah, so there's a problem with the alien. Okay, okay, it sounds garbage right now. Excuse that. A problem with the alien. So the alien has an issue where it hits inside the handle. Of course, nobody really hitting it or I hitting closing it that hard but um somebody posted a youtube video like a week ago where their valves on only made a snapping sound or a clapping sound so that is a problem with the alien and probably should be addressed um but other than that though this thing's a pretty sick uh great beater uh the tip inflicted a lot of damage and you know i feel a little bad for it that flipping montage kind of destroyed the alien but i could still get it to no tap and make it sound super glossy it just needs to be tuned anyway that's about it um bye bye